This video will show you how to change the parameters that you've got set under a quick start or a custom mode. It's very simple to do this. Um, all you need to do is enter the programming mode, change the parameters, and then save over your previous protocol. I'm going to show you how to do that now. As with previous videos, um, it's easiest to change these settings when you have a high pressure oxygen hose and when you have your circuit hooked up with a test lung. That way you won't have any alarms. If an alarm does occur when you're in programming mode, um, just let it run while you're programming, save the mode, and then cancel the alarm. This button here is also a, it's an alarm silence slash reset button. So while it'll cancel alarms, if you press it while you're in a programming mode, it'll also allow you to exit that programming mode without making any changes. So if you ever accidentally enter a programming mode, you simply hit the alarm silence reset, it'll take you out of it without making any changes. So to, over, to uh, oversave the uh, quick starts or custom modes, it's a very easy process. All you need to do, you can see last time I turned it off, I was in an adult quick start. So I'm just going to move it out of that setting just to, for an example. Now we're no longer into that. But um, let's go back to adult quick start. You can see it recalls the settings. And I want to kind of start ventilating in that mode. Now to save over it, what I'm going to do is I'm going to press and hold. When I hear a double beep, I can let go and you'll see it's flashing fast. That's kind of similar to what the initial programming from the factory. But when you're in this programming mode, now you can just change it to whatever settings that you would like to alter. Okay. And then simply press and hold that button again. And you've saved the new protocol. So it is very easy to alter uh, what you'd like to use as your quick start mode. We can do the same thing in child. You can see these were the previously saved settings. I can come in, hold that button down, there it is, hold that button down and then go ahead and change any of my settings and really you can change it to anything so I'm just going to go ahead and put that volume AC mode and then go ahead and save it and what you'll note is uh, let me go to just a different mode to show you the example um, let's just go ahead and make it something very different okay so now we saved our child quick start right we moved that breath per minute up you can see it comes back and, and we've saved over the initial protocol so making changes to your saved quick start settings and custom modes is very easy okay so now we've covered how to overwrite the protocol in the adult and child quick start modes so you can save changing your settings that you'd like to save under those under those modes um, I'd like to go now through how to alter your custom modes if you've already come in and set this up again from the factory it's locked out but once they've been saved once it's very easy to go back and alter those protocols um, and I'm going to show you how to do that in custom mode now so as you remember or may remember when we were setting this up we set adult custom or the custom mode one up as a volume SIMV you notice it just went back because it timed out so you look at these settings first thing you have to do is enter the mode once you've entered that mode all you need to do to enter the programming mode to overwrite the program is simply hold that button down, wait for two beeps, and now change whatever settings you'd like to change, whatever thing you wanted to alter. Let's say it was just a minor change. And then whenever you're ready, um, on the custom modes, you simply hold the custom mode selection and press mode selection. Hold and press. And now we've overwritten the initial protocol and save the custom mode one as a revised protocol. So if you ever need to go in and change the protocol, it's a very simple process. One other thing to note though, if you ever accidentally enter a pre-saved setting and you happen to change something and you but you realized you did it in error, all you need to do is hit this alarm silence. This is also 
it's a reset button. So it'll cancel you out of whatever programming mode that you've entered, either uh, on purpose or accidentally, and take you back to whatever the previously saved mode was. So uh, that covers how to uh, overwrite or update your quick start adult and child protocols and how to update your custom mode selection or your custom mode uh, one, two, and three.